Hi guys, right now you can get $100 from me. To do that, you need meet conditions that you see at the screen in front of you. And I message a winner in Telegram and send him money. The previous videos and transactions are on the scene as well. Do you see this? Did we really do this? Hi young traders! In this video, I will teach you how to correctly identify trends and work with them. There is an expression, a trend is our friend, so today we will confirm it. I remind that I trend at the broker Pocket Option, this is the best broker in our world, so I advise it to you. The link in, uh, will be in the description, be sure to go, register and start earning with me. And here we go. Let's trade today in the several situation, I will consider the seeding and setting and uh, sideways movements. I will learn how to determine them correctly. To begin to, uh, in order to determine the trend, we move to a higher time read, which is M5. We set the expiration time at 3 minutes, which is the best time. Let's proceed with analysis. Here we have a downtrend, a bearish trend. We set the support and resistance levels. How the trend formed. If the trend is uh, descending, there is a decrease in the local minimum and a decrease in local heights. Accordingly, each current is lower than the previous one. Here we have a great situation. We have a reversal and on the reversal we open. And then we determine the movement and th set the levels of support and resistance. From this, we start at a lower time frame to choose an entry point. We set the levels. Now we have a reversal. We switch to a lower time frame level and wait for a corrective movement. We see that the price was approaching this level and the first time it couldn't break through it. Now we expect a correction and open up again the main movement. Let's wait for the close of this candle and uh, open a trade. Um, now there is a corrective movement from the resistance level. Uh, this shade of the candlestick will tell us uh, that the buyers pour the price up. And this big uh, bullish candlestick indicates that the director, uh, direction of a movement will change. There was uh, accumulation here, now we are waiting for the resistance level to be broken through. We are waiting for the close, we see what shadows is formed and open two by trades at once. We wait for the result and move on. Here we have considered an example of a reversal of the downwards movement. We wait for a positive result and move on. So trades are going in the plus, uh, we've done the right analysis, we've identified the trend reversal, break of resistance level, and I've described in the details, and I think you will be able to apply it in your trading. Now let's go to the next situation, let's set the 5 minute time frame, 
we do it in order to determine the movement. It's an ascending movement. The price has bumped up against a resistance level. I think uh, there will be a breakthrough. In the previous movement, we looked at the reversal of the trend. And so here we have a short term uptrend, a bullish trend. Let's move on to the analysis. Um, we set the support and resistance levels. The bullish trend is built on the same principle. Here we uh, have increased the local highs and lows. Uh, here I mark the lows and highs, uh, this sharp impulse of the candle and um, the approach of the resistance level. Let's set the resistance level and move to a lower temperature of M1. Uh, we see the previous situation. Here we have uh, big corrective moves uh, as a resistance level. We expect a corrective movement. The candlesticks shadows indicate that the buyer pushed the price up. We wait for the correction and open it, the deal. A correction is a move against the main movement. So we need a red candle to close. So uh, the close occurs, we open on time from level. The shadow of the candle is big, the fire pushing the price up. We got it right. Oh, we pay attention to the shadow of the candle. Uh, it's a good sign to make deals. The price moves and I think uh, there will be a correction movement. The level was fresh and a quick breakout occurred. The next move is up. I think uh, the corrective movement will be plus or minus to the support level. Uh, in this case, there is a breakout. There was a resistance level here and now it's playing the role of support level. We wait for the correction and now I think goes plus. Uh, let's move on to the next situation. I will try to find a sideways movement. Uh, let's look at this example and perform a technical analysis. Look how well we worked and in time. Uh, and identify the trend. We open right on the trend. So trades are going in the plus and uh, then we look at the next situation. At the lower time frame, we set the downtrend, we switch to a higher time frame and determine the trend. How there is a trend reversal? Uh, it was originally upward movement, resistance level, price has tumbled. Reversal occurs. We switch to a lower time frame and determine the entry points. We expose all the necessary levels, um, resistance and support levels. Let's open from the resistance level, three minutes down. We open in a good position, as I said, it's better to open from levels. Uh, here we have waited for an approach to the level and open a deal. The trend is descending, we wait for the result, maybe a corrective movement. Uh, trees should close on the plus side.
all trades are closing on the plus expiration time has not failed i'm afraid the correction took too long but nevertheless the deal were closed the further movement will be directed down from the resistance level and decrease of the local minimums and maximums also takes place the renewal of it didn't happen the renewal will be only at this point so we could confidently work on the main trend see the sharp impulse um we trend in a good point and close in the plus and uh, now we are going to finish subscribe to the youtube and telegram channel we have free trading signals are given every day which uh, you can get money right i want to join the team and boom work together uh thank you for watching i hope this video uh were useful and with its help you will learn to identify correctly brand reversals and will work with this strategy i showed how to analyze the chart correctly technical analysis so but before you go a quick reminder just for you if you are a beginner and not very good at trading options i recommend you to watch this video moreover if you want to get profitable signals go to my telegram channel and watch the video uh, where i trading with my signals so if you want to be a profitable and reliable strategist i recommend you to watch this video that's all thank you for watching bye